We return now to tonight's breaking news. A missing nine-year-old found dead tonight, and police have her suspected killer in custody. News Channel 15's Drew Blair has been leading our team coverage tonight, and she joins us again now live with a final update. Drew? Well, Mark, we learned that this story that has been gripping our community since early Saturday morning came to the worst conclusion. Nine-year-old Aliana Lemon has been found dead. She was missing since late Friday night, and we've been, of course, covering this through the weekend. I am joined now by Allen County Sheriff Ken Freeze to discuss this case even further. Thank you so much for sticking with us tonight, Sheriff. You do have a person in custody, char preliminary charged with murder. Can you tell us about that arrest? 39-year-old Michael Plumador uh, is the man that she was actually staying with for the last week. He has been charged with murder and actually told us where we could find her remains. And this conversation you had and you be found this uh, with this discovery, this was in a third interview with him? That's correct. We conducted an initial interview the day that she was reported missing, another one on Christmas Eve. He was supposed to come in yesterday on Christmas Day for an interview, didn't make that interview, showed up today at 1 o'clock, and uh, we began an interview that lasted several hours. And at about 9 o'clock tonight, he was taken into custody. You may mention earlier this evening that you had a feeling all along this was the person you needed to be speaking with. Yeah, the story just didn't make sense to our investigators or to me when I first heard it. And I thought this is the guy we needed to focus on. If we were going to find her, he was going to be the one who had the answers for us. Can you address the emotions felt tonight with this conclusion after such a long week and it's so many people working to resolve this case in a better outcome? Yeah, it's a roller coaster because, you know, we were all had hopes that, that in the end we'd find her okay. You know, we were hoping that even after all this work, somebody would call and say, yeah, she's at my house. Sorry, we didn't tell anybody. Um, but as time wears on, you realize that hope probably is not going to be fulfilled. And uh, in the end, it's nice at least to know that we don't have to continue searching. This little lost girl is not lost any longer. It did come to a horrible conclusion, but at least it did come to a conclusion. And, uh, and we have somebody in custody now who can pay the price for it. Sheriff, thank you very much. That person in custody will be in court tomorrow morning, and I will be there to hear his preliminary hearing. And we will have continuing coverage through the night if any more develops. And then, of course, tomorrow on Wayne.com and on our newscast throughout the day. We're live from the Allen County Sheriff's Department North Office. Drew Blair, News Channel 15.